Hey guys, welcome to another lunchtime review. You can't see it, but this is an Arby's. Um, here's the sign way over there. Um, I really can't get a good picture of the building because um, I couldn't park anywhere else. But I'm going to run in here and get, they have some new um, boneless um, wings um, that look really good. Chicken wings that look really, really good. And uh, so I'm going to head in here and um, here I'll show you the sign. Um, yeah, can I have a, um, a six-piece uh, boneless wings? Can I have, uh, actually I need two of them, one of the classic buffalo and six-piece in the hot honey. So you want one of each? Yeah, one of each, and I don't need a drink or fries or anything. All right, what else for you? That's it. Hey, that's very, thank you. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you. That was pretty, pretty quick. Um, I got through in like two minutes, literally. From the time I started recording till, till just now, it's been two minutes, so that's pretty good. So I'm gonna go find a place to park. Okay, here are the wings and they are quite saucy. I mean, they've dipped those in, that, that's the buffalo one. And that's the hot honey. Um, you can tell they really put them in some sauce. So they squirted them, squirted on there and shook them up really good. So they are saucy, saucy little chicken nuggets. So, or boneless ribs, whatever, or boneless wings. Um, so anyway, I'm going to turn this around. Got plenty of napkins, luckily. And I've got a sauce here too. I didn't, uh, didn't show that, but there's, there's the package of sauce. So uh, I will uh, be right back. Okay, so the price was $3.79 each, so six pieces of boneless wings. Um, so six pieces was $3.49, or $3.79. You got the ranch sauce as well for free, of course, part of that price. It was $7.58 for both of them. Sales tax in Kentucky was $0.45. Cents. So my total was $8.03, which is not too awfully bad. I'm wondering which one of these is going to be the hottest. That's what I'm wondering. So I'm going to experiment a bit. They gave me a fork, which is probably a good thing. They gave me a fork. I'm just going to take my finger and touch the sauce. And let me see how hot it is. So that was the buffalo. Got that really good buffalo sauce flavor, that vinegary kind of flavor. Has a little burn in the back of your throat. So that's, that's one. Let me try the hot honey sauce. Oh okay, yeah, that's more of a, uh, the buffalo is more of that buffalo hot sauce kind of um, heat. The hot honey is more of a um, like black pepper kind of heat. So that's that kind of hot. I think I'm going to try, I'm going to try it with, the, I'm just going to get a fork because I know how this is going to go. I'm going to make a teetotal mess, but I'm going to take, take my fork and I'm going to dip it in the ranch sauce because that's the way they're intended to be eaten. So there we go. Make sure I got a napkin. And when you got a beard and mustache, you're gonna get stuff all in. That's good, I like that ranch. The ranch adds a lot of um, um, flavor to it. It helps cool it down and these are very, very hot. Just to let you know. Uh, let me take a bite without the ranch. I like the flavor of the ranch. I mean, the buffalo. If you like buffalo chicken wings, I think you'll really like this. It does have that good spicy, um, that hot sauce kind of flavor, which I really do like. Let me dig in here and really get some ranch. I'll tell you what, I really like it with the ranch. The ranch, um, Adds a lot of flavor to it. You wouldn't think um, you wouldn't think ranch would add that much flavor. I've got sauce on my seat next to me. I don't know how that happens. Um, I must have it on me somewhere. Um, anyway, the um, it's really good, and you wouldn't think ranch would help add to the flavor of that because they're so strong. But um, yeah, if you don't like hot food, no way you're ever gonna buy these because they are hot. Um, 
And of course you would, I mean, they're buffalo. Some buffalo though doesn't have heat. They just have the flavor. These have heat, so just know that. Now I'm interested, very, very interested to try these honey ones. The honey ones don't look quite as big. They, they look a little smaller. I don't know why, but they, but they do. Let me, I'm gonna try a bite without any ranch. I just been for it. See the whole time. They are sweet. You do get that honey flavor, but you also get a pepper flavor, like a like almost like black pepper spice. It's almost that kind of heat. I don't think they're quite as hot as the buffalo are the heat is not really like burning my throat like um like the buffalo did although it's got some heat don't get me wrong but i think the the hot honey are a little less hot to me than um than the buffalo now heat affects people differently let me get a small one um heat affects people differently so like i could eat these and i could say one thing but you eat these and you might think something completely different so just know even though I think the hot honey are not as hot, you might try them out and think they're like scalding hot compared to the buffalo. So, you know, it's, everybody's different. Let me try it with the ranch. I gotta really get in there and get a good, good scoop of it. Hmm. I really like that sweet. You get that sweet, you get a really strong like pepper flavor and then you get that really good ranch flavor i like the combination of that um they're both really really good for what they are i can just say that what which one i would buy personally would be the hot honey because i really do like the flavor of the the heat and the honey and the sweetness and then the uh, the ranch sauce i really like that combination that being said these are both getting five out of five for me. I really do think they're they're good. It's a good deal too. Three seventy something for three a three eight less than three eighty for six pieces of fairly well spiced nuggets. And uh, like I said, the chicken, the chicken nuggets on the. Let me hold on. Let me get one of each, and you can kind of see the comparison. Let me get a bigger one of the hot. Let me get a comparison here going. There's the difference in the size of the nuggets. So the hot, the hot honey one is just a little bit smaller than the chicken, than the, the other one, but that could just be, you know, just by choice. I mean, that could be just random. I mean, that's just a random choice. So anyway, five out of five, both of them. I think they're really, really good. My personal choice would be the hot honey, but um, again, the Buffalo Ranch, if you, I mean the, yeah, the Buffalo, the Buffalo sauce ones, if you really like the Buffalo sauce ones, get those because I think you'll really be pleased with it. So yeah, I think they're really good. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching. I want to give you a little bit of follow-up. First of all, these are really hot. Ooh, um, the hot honey ones are hot. They make your lips tingle <laughs> and they make your uh, back of your throat burn. But I didn't really talk about the texture of the wings themselves. I didn't think about it. Um, they have a crisp coating on them, like a crispy uh, a chicken nugget. Um, but they're not like a, they're not like a breading. They're not like a McDonald's chicken nugget. They're actually like a like a Kentucky Fried Chicken kind of, not quite extra crispy, but kind of like that. It's got a crispy coating on it um, that's thicker and crispy. So you do get some crunch with it as well as all the sauce. So don't think it's just like a, a very thin breading that's on there like you would get like at, at McDonald's. It's not like that. It's more like a wing um, or a boneless chicken finger or something like that you would get somewhere. Um, and after eating both of them, excuse me, a hot food, whew, um, I still like the hot honey better, although it is that pepper, pepper flavor really, really came through uh, really strong. And uh, that was still the best tasting one, but you do get some heat from them. And the, uh, the buffalo were, um, were also very, very hot, but in the traditional buffalo sauce hot. So anyway, I want to talk about the texture a little bit. It does have a good crisp coating on it. Um, you can tell they're not reprocessed. They actually look like uh, sliced chicken. So it, it actually has the, the layers of chicken like chicken wood it doesn't have like a processed pressed patty like uh, texture so that's excellent i think that's really good so they do a good job as long as they keep it up on putting that amount of sauce on them i would like them um, my fear is that as they go on 
they'll start putting less and less sauce on them. So if you get a really uh, low amount of sauce on them, they may not be quite as good. Although I think the hot honey would probably coat pretty well anyway. Um, and honestly, the buffalo ones, if you had a little less sauce on it, it'd probably be fine. But I think they were perfect the way they were. Hopefully they don't get cheap and, and lessen the amount of sauce on it. So anyway, hope you enjoyed. Talk to you later.